Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another rugby reaction. Today we're going to be checking out the URC finals between the Vodacom uh, Bulls and the Glasgow Warriors. Um, yeah, we did the uh, semi-finals, uh, was that a week, a week ago? A week ago or so? Uh, yeah, two, two pretty good games, but yeah, the, the highlights that they had uploaded on the on the channel um, weren't the like most in depth or whatever. So um, we're gonna do something a bit different today. We're gonna do the um, I've got I've got the highlights they have posted for the grand final, and then I also have the incredible, incredibly tense final ten minutes. So what I'm gonna do is I'll react up until there's the, until it's like the seventy minute mark, whenever that is, and then we'll switch over to the the, the full ten minute re thing here. Um, yeah, so that'll be exciting to watch. Get to see more of like how how the game ended exactly and all that. So yeah, that'll be really cool. Um, and yeah, before we hop in, I also I did check out the Wikipedia page for the URC just to see like if Glasgow's won, if Vodacom has won. Um, and it doesn't look like the um, Glasgow won 2014-15. I don't think the Bulls um, have won before, from what I see. Uh, I'm trying not to scroll down too far so I don't see who won today's or so I don't see, don't see who won this year's uh, thing. But yeah, I think the Bulls might have got second once or twice maybe. But um, yeah, so yeah, excited, excited to watch this. Um, yeah, Glasgow versus Vodacom Bulls. Um, yeah, should, should be a good one. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a sub, drop a like, comment your thoughts on the game and all that, uh, that stuff. Um, yeah, let's just hop into it of last week's semi-final and now underneath the, All right. the hoist as well um i'm gonna cheer for glasgow in this game apologies to any uh south african fans um, i have some scottish heritage so we'll go with glasgow for this one points in the season's competition puts him second on the standings to open the scoring in the grand finals and he has snuck it over Dude, that was that was really early in the game are there another one? Okay. Third line out in this part of the field in quick succession. We'll be desperate to make this count. Let it go. Jeez, there you go. Pure force. Okay, big lead for the for the Bulls early. 13-0 at the half almost. Can Glasgow get us here? This is the right the right there. Can you get it? I think they got it. They got it. Nice. Get right the buzzer. Awesome. Okay. 16-7. All shifting sideways. So backs in to make a difference. Jordan and Kyle Stain as well. Same all. Still rumbling over the line. Are we going to get another one? Yeah. This this zoomed in counter view is tripping me out. I'm not really how close they are to the to the try. All right. Much closer game now. 16-14. And Dobie looping around beautifully. Ooh, what a play. Was Mackay and Stain. Stain. Kyle Stain. Did you get it? No. Five short. Five short, okay. Yeah, this camera will strip me out. <laughs> no, they go yeah, it looks the like they're about to get another Ferguson. one here. The Warriors. Oh, what a step. Mackay, what a pass. Oh. Just cannot get outside. Ooh. Harold Forster, who clings on for dear life. Nice with the middle. Well to tip it on his first receiver. Then Dobie filling in at scrum half. Oh, look at the dude! The movement is crazy. Oh, nice. Yeah, there's another one. Okay. So that's a big comeback. What was it? Thirteen nothing. All right, up by five. Okay, we're almost gonna switch over to the. Oh, turnover. Is he gone? Uh. Yeah, he's got that. He's got that. All right, big lead for Glasgow now. Twenty up by ten. Jeez. What happened? Yes, Mateo, put that on the screen. Hopefully, this is a try. And Papier was looking for the offload. Yeah, it's an early tackle. Early tackle? Okay. Mm, that was right on the. Hmm. Jeez. All right, that was like, yeah, that was like as the ball came to him. No try. Early tackle. Jeez. All right. All right, that's a major call right there. All right, okay. Oh shit. Okay, let me let me uh, skip over to the to the this this point.
All right, guys. Yeah, here's the incredible, incredibly tense final ten minutes. Looks like he got spoiled a tiny bit there. Down down yeah, yeah, just keep going. Six we'll, we'll watch this uninterrupted here. With ball in hand. No, lost. Never on the ball. Man, the crowd's crazy. What, what was the what was the uh, what were the crowd numbers for this game? Must have been massive. For a clean out around the net, took the lead for the first time. Still plenty of time to go. It is Reinhard Ludwig who gets into the air. Henko Fenter comes off the back of that line out though to feed Jack Dempsey. <laughs> oh, then Ludwig makes the charge. Get right back, get back. Kick. And in go the balls. In the air. 19, still in the I need to know the um the ref does different like hand signals for different calls, right? I believe like in hockey they do that as well. Like like certain penalties are different are different hand movements. If that's the case for for rugby, let me know. Let me know so I can remember that going forward. So I don't know, know what happened exactly. Yeah, okay, are they gonna lose a penalty? I think did they hit this? No, I think I think they missed this right based on what we saw in the highlight package. I believe. Just to get beyond seven points. And yeah, he was short. He was short. Underneath the crossbar. Wilson. Good. With a huge clearance kick, but not into touch. Tom Jordan. Ludwig. Across to make the tackle. Nathan Macbeth with a strong carry. Stain. A willing carrier up the short side. They're happy to have ball in hand. Use it! When is this disallowed try occur? It's got to be soon, right? Or was that before this started? Macbeth again makes himself available. And that left short side has been popular. No! Lost! Use it! Watch out for the contestable coming soon. Henko Fenter. Henko Fenter, that's a cool name. Been a revelation for the Glasgow Warriors, the former Sharks man. All right. Former Shark. The the shark are, aren't the Sharks in the South African team? Unless I'm mistaken, I feel like they. I feel like they are, but maybe maybe I'm wrong there. Short side again, they go. Stain. Tupelotu asking for options. Jack Dempsey yet again. This time it's a ball's penalty. Okay. And this must be when it happens, right? Around here, I think. When the early tackle appears, maybe? Or no? And Hurson's kick. Oh. Is that going to bounce? It is going to bounce dead. Scrum. Yeah. A scrum all the way back. Okay. He's looking for Lorne and well he might. <laughs> Set. Stay straight. Born manages to grab from the base of Ooh, the just goes straight up. Stain lining himself up behind. Oh, what a run! Discipline vital here. Yeah, I'd prefer if the camera angle was a bit further out for these, but I guess, yeah, I guess it's you need to see like really up close what's happening with the ball. But I do like being able to see like more of the field. Just so I can see the, like, where the play could go easier. A little chip in. No. Alright, five minutes left. Bulls need to get the ball. Yeah, the Bulls haven't had the ball in this entire year. There we go, though. Mo. The guy in the middle. <laughs> the guy in the middle is just getting squished on both sides. Shifting into the five meter area. 
Jeez, this is wild. It's such a huge difference watching this compared to rugby league. It's it's wild how like two like two different the two codes are just so different watching them. Ooh, big tackle. Contact in the midfield. Tom Jordan, it was. Right. I'm assuming the disallowed try we saw in the other highlight reel was before this occurred. It was, was before this 10 minute, final 10 minutes, so. Yeah, now we're just seeing the ending here. I guess the Bulls are going to make a run for it here. Try, try to get a try to get a game winning uh, try. End kick. Oh, man. They have been miserly all competition. And now, when they've needed it the most in the grand final, the defensive system has stood up once again. It takes something very special in these last three minutes and a few seconds to breach it. It's just like pure, like... Just willing, willing the ball forward. How did he keep that? That was crazy. Started again, and now appeared with men away to his right. The halfway mark. Oh, there's a little space. Oh, that's good. Good, good yards there. Here's there. Penalty. Oh no. What happened? Is that the last shot fired? Not for me. Not for me. Yeah, that might be it there. Not yet. The team is checking. Another big defensive set. Out on the field. Five of them down. What? Yeah. What happened here? Why is this? Push down tackle in on it. Survives the first. Oh, they just ripped the ball out. Yeah, yeah. Tom Jordan, who's been playing defense all that time. She is no. Alright. Guys with me, please. Okay, Mateo. Wow, gonna play in three, they've won one, lost two. Okay. Yeah. And Bulls haven't won though, right? And From what I read? Yeah. Let's go play, yeah, on number A team blue. Might be the tackle I was referring to. Yeah. yeah. What are we looking at? Now that's the one that we saw in real time. What's the issue here? Extending his arms to receive the pass. Short. Yeah. Okay, and there, this one. Very upright, shoulder to the head. Shoulder to the head, okay. I've got, yeah, full play, upright, coming to speed. So the Bulls might get the ball back here then, because of that. Any clear mitigation right now? Yeah, that was that was head. Didn't look like it didn't didn't do any damage to him, I don't think, but um, I know nonsense with head contact now, right? Can you show me again in real speed, please? to touch to determine the level of danger. Okay, Andrea. Thank you. I love how rugby and rugby league does the replays where it's like publicly on the field, everyone can see the replay at the same time. High level danger. Okay, Are you going to so do like a sin bin? Jeez, okay, sin bin with five, like three minutes left or so? Uh, give him the number, please. Number 10. Number 10. Yeah. I can see why people don't like this type of replay, though. I, I, I know you guys have talked about this in the comments a bunch about how the rules are getting in the way of the sport, but um, yeah, that's that's wild. How much review they did there just to do that. So Bulls, Bulls have a chance. And we need to get an extra time. All right. Ludwig with the take. Looked as though his body buckled a little in the air. This guy goes a man down. Down by blue. Play on, play on, play on. Embrace Papier. Ooh. 
seeing the whole defensive line up outside him back towards his forwards you're getting closer if they can draw another penalty here yes. they can find a more favorable field position 22 meter line okay i got a fundamental now they come back towards the left ludwig they have superior numbers over here to the left. Gorsen, though, looks back to his inside for Ulrich Lowe. Mm -hmm. Away! I guess I don't need to look at the clock too much because the, the game is an end. Oh, oh! Penalty. Penalty. 40 seconds to go. Jeez, <laughs> what's going to happen? <laughs> yeah, the, the game doesn't end, right? It doesn't end at the 80 minute. It, it keeps going until the possession changes. Let's see. That's point accurate with this kick. And it has been. All right. Brave. But necessarily brave. Now that five meters off. Now you got a ball at the previous line out attack. I can't believe the Bulls went back to the ball. So nearly lost it at source. And then again, it was one pass. This is run, wild. One pass run. No one in motion. Now you got to get on your goal line attack. And your goal line attack is being. Jeez, they're like right there. Oh my god. Run no kill. First job done. Jeez, it's just like a wall of bodies. Oh. Penalty advantage, but the ball lost forward. Penalty against Cummings. Penalty, okay. Collapsing them all. Thank you, Craig. Okay. Cool coming from Craig Evans. Jeez, this is insane. Even, even if they do get the try here, they gotta kick. They gotta kick right to get to win. So they almost gotta make sure they get like in the in the middle, so the kickers get a chance too. Man, those guys are so ready to just jump on the field and celebrate, but it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Dude, look how, how many people are there! Oh my God. Oh my god. No way. Where is it? Where's the ball? <laughs> no one knows where it is. <laughs> Look at the ref. The ref's like. <laughs> wow. Wow. Jeez. Glasgow, let's go. That was insane. That was the craziest ending. Mm -hmm. But then they had to travel. Crazy stuff. Notoriously difficult time and talk where they defeated the defending champions. That's wild. Can you stand there? Yeah, let me take a look at the ending again really quick. So, yeah, this, I, this I'm confused on. So, what, what exactly happened here that caused the game to end? Was it that the. The ball is held up, yeah. Hmm. Yeah. This, this is this is one of the rules I've always been confused about, kind of as we go through uh, the rugby journey and stuff. Like, yeah, like what caused the game to end here? The ball was held up. Is that me? Like, yeah. Maybe I'll, I'll look that up right now. Actually, that was a that was a a mall, right? Uh, rugby mall. Let me just see if I can figure figure that out really quickly. Okay, here we go. A mall ends unsuccessfully when the ball becomes unplayable. The mall collapses, not as a result of foul, foul play. The mall does not move towards the goal line for longer than five seconds. The ball does not emerge. Okay, I think I think number three is what happened there then, I believe, or it becomes unplayable. I think number three makes more sense, though. Yeah, the mall does not move towards the goal line for longer than five seconds, and the ball does not emerge. I think, I think that makes sense, yeah. Yeah, I think I think that's what happened. All right. Anyways, Kate, that that was sick. That was sick. Um, let us take a look at the comments really quick. I've been starting to do this in more of my reactions because it's it's pretty pretty fun to read this stuff here. But yeah, let's see. Yeah, what a privilege to play in the URC three finals, three different nations winning the title. Well done, Glasgow, from a gutted bull supporter. Awesome comment from that guy. 
Uh, what a win for Glasgow. Congratulations. Winning in Thor Thomond Park and Loft on consecutive weekends. Always great to see the underdog pull through and go all the way. Great for Scottish rugby and the URC. Yeah. Fish hitting was superb as well. Okay. All right. Yeah. Pretty, pretty surprised by the comments, actually. Seems everyone's pretty... Uh, I figured there'd be more like... Um, what's the word? Uh controversy maybe for the ending but i guess no i guess that i guess that was that that was the right those are the right calls for the most part and everyone's um just happy to see a good game so that's awesome well well done fans uh, i'll take a look at these ones too just just in case but yeah yeah pretty much all pretty much the same stuff yeah all right so that was my reaction to the urc 2024 uh grand finals um amazing stuff um i wish i kind of had been reacting to more urc throughout the season but yeah i just never really got around to to getting to the, into the pro pro rugby stuff um but yeah so i do have um uh i believe top 14 is the semifinals like just occurred or something or are nearing um so i'll, I'll get a good reaction to those up in the next day or two hopefully um then we'll do the finals for that as well um if there's anything else i need to react to from from the pro side of rugby that's um occurred lately let me know for sure um, and then yeah, for for this for this game, the Bulls Warriors. Let me know. Uh, let me know more, more about the teams. Let me know about their players. Um, uh, if there are any any of you guys are fans of either team, let me know uh, if there's like a like who's like the best player on each team and all that stuff. Um, yeah, yeah, awesome game, awesome finish. Um, yeah, like I was saying a bit earlier in the reaction, it's crazy how much different the game looks um, on, in rugby and rugby league. It's like. Uh, it's like they're two different sports. Uh, you guys know this, but yeah, it's like it's crazy the difference in in and how the game is played. Um, yeah, yeah. Well, let's wrap it up there. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to uh, like the video, comment, subscribe, uh, join the Discord if you if you're interested in that. Um, yeah, we'll wrap it up there. Thanks for watching.